Hello, my people. Welcome back to my channel. This is Brenda, the guinea pig. I'm going to be showing you how I prep my hair for the relaxer. Wearing this hair for the relaxer, and I'm going to be doing it on myself, by myself. Today, I'm not going to go to the salon. Since I started this channel, I have to learn how to do things on my own because when you take care of your hair by yourself, it grows. This is the kind amount of growth I have. It's thick and my hair is well moisturized because I sh as I showed you in the video that I uploaded. So if you've not yet watched it, go ahead and watch it. Yeah, you'll find it how I moisturized this eight months long growth to submission yeah and please go ahead and subscribe subscribe it's free it's free and doesn't post the video subscribe and like the video yeah and hit that notification bell while you're at it yeah okay guys let's get into the video well guys things you're going to need gloves yeah, then some petroleum jelly and a white tooth comb and a partitioning comb. I'm going to be using this one. So guys, let's get into it before my son wakes up. First, you're going to have to detangle your hair properly so that there are no tangles left. This will ease your process of relaxing your hair. Now, the only way that detangling will be as easy as you can see in this video is if you keep your hair moisturized. And I'm showing you the amount of breakage I got from detangling. That's because I did a protein treatment prior to this process right now. I did a protein treatment two weeks ago before this date in the video. So there's less breakage. Since doing the... What? You forgot the gloves. I knew I needed the gloves. After detangling, you'll go ahead and section off your hair. I did four parts but i first did the first two parts then after that i separated the two parts in two two parts again you know how it goes so separate your hair so that you can easily work with it guys where do these things run off to i have like six of them but i can't find i i only found this where do they run to as I continue to figure out where these puff holders run off to like spoons and forks in the house. Let me continue sectioning my hair <laughs> and dealing with my present day <laughs> challenges of hair. But if you find a solution, please hit me up in the comment section. I'll check that place and see if I find them. Yeah, thank you. If you can get clips.
uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be getting the petroleum jelly then I'm going to be slathering that all over my re previously relaxed hair I do this to protect my hair I think I've already told you this to protect my hair from being over processed I do this then after I'll twist up my my part my partition I don't know how to do it how to say it how to call it but I'll twist it up my section to keep it that way such that when I'm self-relaxing it's easier for me because I'll just be getting piece by piece or portion by portion yeah you can see me twisting it up here if you've not yet please subscribe I twist it up then I go ahead and base my scalp because I have a very sensitive scalp it's very sensitive I can't even put self on my head <laughs> it's that sensitive <laughs> Yeah, I base my scalp so that I don't get burns. And if any time I get a small issue of relaxing my hair, I just run to the sink because I don't want to be burnt. I would rather have under-processed hair than having burns in my head. I basically do this throughout my entire head. Though in this video, I'm going to be showing only two parts of this the parts of this side but i'll be coming in with a picture of me with the finished work then there's the skull i hope you get the gist hey love subscribe please now guys when you're doing this please remember to be gentle be gentle with your hair so that you don't cause much friction onto your scalp which may lead into burns just be gentle i would have fast forward this but i wanted to show you real time how how much speed i use in this process also don't forget to take extra care for your ends because they are the oldest part of your hair and they need more attention so that they don't break off when you take care of the ends then you you gain length yeah and we are trying to grow long healthy relaxed hair so just take extra care of them that way now you can see the line of demarcation between my relaxed hair and my new growth that's where i'm placing the jelly so that it can protect my re former relaxed hair i'll be uploading my self-relaxing video first ever raw footage very soon like in three days so please hit the, no hit the notification bell so that you can get notified when i do and please while you're twisting your hair avoid this i don't know I'll explain it to you. Let me just show you. Avoid doing this. Yeah? Make sure that your portions and don't go to and not mixed up. Because when washing out the relaxer, you wouldn't want the the, the relaxer to be stuck in on your hair because you are untwisting your hair. For these ones when you put them in water when they meet with water they will just automatically unfold themselves as i was telling you hit the no notification bell so that when i upload my self-relaxing <laughs> hair you get notified i promise you you want to see this <laughs> jesus christ just hit that bell you'll want to see this it's really funny but i'll get the hang of it i'll get the hang of it probably next time i'll do better <laughs> now things that i didn't show you in this video 
that I did prior to my relaxer include a protein treatment. I did I did this two weeks ago. Yeah. I did it two weeks ago. I got my mayonnaise and put an egg for extra protein. Yeah. And you can see while I was detangling my hair, there was little to no breakage. So please you'd want to first do a protein treatment on your hair before you go ahead and relax it because it will make it stronger. Remember when relaxing, you're going to be breaking down the bones of the hair, making it weaker. So please do that protein treatment. Your hair will thank you for it. Now the other thing I did was keep my hair moisturized at all times. I made sure I put enough moisture in my hair. That way detangling would be easier on my scalp. And just in case you don't know how to deal with your new growth, how to moisturize it, go ahead and check out my channel. There is a video on how you can properly moisturize your hair without using water. This is because all the products that I use in my video are intensely filled with water. Yeah, so they'll keep your hair moisturized without the dampness of what that water provides. The other thing you'll want to do is to avoid as much as you possibly can. Avoid scratching your scalp. I know, I know, the closer you get to relax a day, the more, it, the more itching you will experience. So please try your best, try your best. Keep th those hands out of your head. <laughs> yeah, if you feel... Itching, try to tap it a little bit, but don't scratch your scalp. And if you're enjoying the video so far, please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. It makes YouTube happy and it gets to recommend my video to other people who may need it. So please be a giver that way. Give me a thumbs up. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you for that. Thank you for that like. And also tell a sister to tell a sister to tell a brother to tell a sister to tell a wife to, to just share this video or just recommend my channel to someone you know is relaxed, has relaxed and is struggling. Yeah. Recommend it. Recommend this channel to them. Let's grow together. Now guys, you're going to forgive me because I was not able to put the entire process in one video because motherhood happens. But I did come back and show you the finished result. And I hope this was helpful, though it was not showing you the entire head, but what I did on this side of the head is the same thing that I did on the other side of the head. The only thing that I went extra and did, that was the day of the relaxer, is I burst my hairline. Yeah. My entire hairline and my edges too. Because I want these edges to grow back. The micro twists did a number on them. And here is Mr. <laughs> yeah. So thank you so much for supporting me. Thank you so much for loving me. Catch you on the next, in the next video. And don't become a stranger. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel. And recommend, engage in the comment section. Thank you so much. God bless you. See you some other time. Bye-bye. Again, Brenda.